I'm back with another awesome video. This one is dedicated to all the skaters out there, all the stoners, all the hip hop heads, and to anyone involved in the streetwear, subcultures, community, that sort of thing. Quick side note, um, back when I got my half evil X codon rug in 2020, I forget which month, but you can check out the video if you are so inclined. I was, so shortly after I got that rug, I was thinking to myself, kind of daydreaming late at night, you know, when you're lying in bed and your mind's just racing, thinking of all these different things that you got going on. And I was thinking, man, what type of rug would I want next? If I could have any rug, any design, what would it be? And I swear I manifested this shit into reality because the number one thing that I was envisioning in my mind was, you guessed it, the Atom Bomb logo. Had to get it the second I saw it. I almost missed it, it sold out really fast, but I managed to snag it and uh, here we go. So as you can see, it has fairly uh, good binding holding it together. Made out of a nice sturdy material. I'm pretty sure it's 100% cotton. Ooh, look at that pop of color. Ba bam. Wham. Fucking awesome, man. There he is. I think I'm gonna put this little guy in one of my downstairs rooms. This has to be one of my all time favorite logos. Very, uh, very classic. Reminds me of the good old days. Oh, look who's trying to, no, no, you have your scratch pads right there. Showing you some close up so you can see how well it's made. So this rug is, mm, I'd like to say about five feet, maybe about, oh, what is that? Maybe four feet across, six feet long. So all my hundred, all my old hundreds gear is missing. Um, I think I have like a couple beat up t-shirts and I got these old shorts from 2015 um, that I got in New York back in the day. Yeah, that's, that's soft, isn't it? I'm gonna have to watch this little one though, make sure she doesn't tear it up, scratch it up, you know? But, um, 
It was fairly expensive, I'd say, but worth it. It was 450 American, which works out to about 500 Canadian with uh with all the taxes and everything um i was lucky enough to have a friend transport it all the way from texas across america to my crib in canada so shouts out mystery bis he also brought me back some artwork from Ecuador. So let's open this up. Looks like it's by Galeras. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but this looks beautiful. Thanks, man. Wow. So yeah, I'm really fortunate because it is unbelievable how much the international duties and extra fees are. You already pay extra taxes, but then to get things into Canada, get things important, imported, is quite the, the, the fee you gotta pay. So I did have to wait couple extra months to get a hold of this but it was worth it this came out in December 2021 right and I was worried that it was going to be token gated behind joining the atom bomb squad and buying an nft oh man yeah you can lie on it but don't scratch So I was worried that uh, I'd have to buy a, an NFT and I'm not a crypto trader. What do I look like? But no, for the big ticket items, you could buy it with cash dollar, dollar dollar bill, that guap. Okay. And the resale value has skyrocketed. I saw this on StockX not too long ago for 12. Now it's down to about one. It's still going for double the price that I paid for it. So, you know, this is something to look out for if you wanna make a quick flip, getting on that hundreds. Make sure to like and subscribe it's been Galley Glowed Up with The Atom Bomb Rug by The Hundreds. Y'all have a wonderful day and rest of the month. <laughs>